но мне форма царской армии, на других черкесские папахи. Мы разные, но нас объединила ненависть к большевикам. Мы трижды пытались взять город. Взятие Царицына — это ободряющий клич всему миру, презирающему коммунистов. Большевики жгут села и запугивают крестьян. Вот она, их свобода. Я грузил пушки в очрево спящего поезда, огромного стального монстра. Сегодня войну выигрывает тот, кто контролирует железные дороги. Soldiers, Lieutenant General Rangel has given clear orders. We must stand our ground at the red line here. Should we lose this position, we will then retreat to Zivina's ruins. We must use the ruins for cover, or we may be overrun. If this should happen, then we must fall back to this area of the Don River. Failure here would mean retreating into Tsaritsyn itself. Let the past be our future. For Mother Russia! Врача! We are losing objective butter. Those who would destroy Russia with a filthy propaganda have been defeated. Let the revolution drown in blood and dirt. There is no way back for them. The past is our future. Had the White Army succeeded in holding Tsaritsyn and kept control of the Volga River, access to oil and grain would have surely strengthened their tiring forces. With fuel in their tanks and food in their stores, perhaps their subsequent march on Moscow would have been successful and seen the volunteer army put an end to the socialist revolution. Had the Reds lost Tsaritsyn, perhaps Commissar Joseph Stalin's position in the Bolshevik ranks would not have been so favorable, and so the future of Soviet Russia would have looked very different indeed. <laughs> 